hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel i'm back again with another interesting repair video today i'm gonna do a repair this uh tbs unified pro 5 volt version uh which has a bad power regulator and uh, this sent it to me by sack fpv i think you guys remember uh, i did a, a repair video for kiss v2 flight controller uh, that one also sent to me by SAC. So today I'm gonna uh, do diagnose this uh, uh, VTX and let's see. Let's quickly do a physical inspection. and look at this we have a bad voltage regulator you can see there's a uh, damage on the component so uh, i assume that we have the problem with this one this regulator passing 5 volt to the uh, fm transmitter in here and uh, let's uh, hook up the power leads and feed the power and see what we get okay now i'm gonna feed the power and see the the vtx whether it's working or not first of all we need to plug in the pigtail and the power adapter as well power connector okay now turning on the power supply yes we have power you can see LED indications that's mean uh, we have power but I don't have any vision of this uh, VTX we should have 5 volt here but we are having 0 0.1 this is a switch line and we have 3.5 volt here uh, this line directly goes to this voltage regulator uh, which is powering up the power amplifier side so we are having 5 volt here that means we have this uh, bad voltage regulator you can see there is a small damage so let's uh, replace this one and see this time I am not going to use uh, my hot air station uh, and I am going to remove this using the soldering iron Okay, I took off this voltage regulator like this. We need to rid of this solder board. Right, okay now we have brand new package okay I had to change the soldering tip
Okay, it's soldered well and let's clean up the board. Okay, I replaced the voltage regulator and uh, I uh, soldered the power and the camera as well. Now it's time to test. Let's power it up. Okay, we have the power. Okay, now we have vision. Uh, you can see the video. Okay, this is the VTX this I repaired and I think uh, this uh, VTX in a pit mode or low power mode because we are having so much of noise the VTX is working as expected now my repair is done so I believe that you all learned something from this video you have enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel if you have any broken or damaged stuff for repair videos i'm really appreciate for that so stay tuned for next repair video bye bye